Hey guys, Jotman here. We're in it today on or Bloom's Tower Defense 6. Uh, as you can see, we've already started and we got a Sandra placed down as well as a boomerang. Um, as this goes on, we're just going to go ahead and attempt to increase our boomerangs uh, upgrades here so they're more able to defend against the blooms. With that out of the way, I should probably tell you what we're doing here. Um, so this is impoppable. Uh, we are trying to see as far as we can get on this. So if you guys are struggling with this one, uh, you are more than welcome to use my strat. I know there's a lot of strats out of there. Um, and they have a lot of value to them. Um, as you can see, I put down a sniper monkey. He's going to help us deal with our leads and camos here at the beginning. Um, and then after that, we're just kind of saving up. I really want to get into this main Moab. Um, and that is going to allow me to stall the Moabs at the beginning. As you can see, our Boomerang Monkey and Sandra up there are just killing it at the front. And the Sniper is really there as support. But we're going to go ahead and save up. There's my main Moab. Um, that means we are ready for round 40. I'm going to throw down a Dart Monkey in the back just to be safe. And here we go. Ceramics are no problem for Sandra. Boomerang Monkey's got it. And the Sniper. Um, and then now we can just kind of continue on business as usual. We want to go ahead and upgrade our boomerang monkey again. I'm throwing down a monkey village and hitting some jungle drums to make them attack faster as well. I'm throwing down a discount code. Uh, next, I'm going to go ahead and start my banana farms. Um, I'm going to throw down both of them so you can kind of see what they both do. Uh, as well as uh, money wise as far as path goes so you can see one's a valuable one's an extra production i put them in marketplaces i just don't want to have to think about them um, so they aren't the most profitable um, banks are the most profitable this way i honestly don't have to worry and it's just going to keep generating me money i'm a very lazy towers player uh, so i don't like to do a whole lot of micromanaging all right, we just threw down a ninja monkey. We're going to go ahead and upgrade them. Eventually, we want to get them to a balloon seven order, and then we're just going to go ahead and increase our farming elements. Next is the monkey ace, and we're going to go ahead and increase their path to a never miss, and that way they just keep popping balloons for us, and eventually we'll go to the next upgrade. We just upgraded to a Spectre. This one is going to be our main popper for this run. They, they are incredibly powerful and will take out almost anything. I almost messed up. I did have to use Sandra's ability here, but she goes and go ahead and clean up these balloons and hopefully I don't make another mistake like that again the rest of the run. I'm going to go ahead and create a monkey wizard here and then we're going to go ahead and move him into the prince of darkness class and he's going to take care of a lot of balloons coming through including the ddps uh, later so a very very powerful monkey if you have a chance to get him in your runs i would highly recommend Here we're going to go ahead and upgrade into the Flying Fortress. It's going to be our big bad for the run, um, and essentially it's going to eliminate everything up to level 100, so let's see how far we can get. I also threw down another Boomerang Monkey. We're going to go ahead and upgrade him into the Moab Press, and that's going to knock the rest of the Moabs back. Uh, it's not really necessary, but it is extremely helpful, so it's definitely a good monkey to have. There you go, there's level 100, and it doesn't even make it past the first curve, so it's the strategy is a winner. But you can see how far we can get in total. 
Alrighty guys, we are at level 200. Unfortunately, I have the benefit of hindsight and we don't make it past this. However, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, as always, I've been Jotman and we'll catch you in the next video. Thanks.